okay so we are back here again guys i'm so sorry i know it's been like over oh like three years since i've been here okay, i just wanted to come in here to show you guys my updated foundation and beat face during the day slay what the fuck hey hey type makeup tutorial that i've just decided to put together for you guys because i've been doing a lot of things differently i've used a lot of different products i'm buying a lot of new shit so therefore this is gonna be a little bit different from time to time okay you gotta switch it up <laughs> Let me not even get like carried away with the voiceover because I'm so excited to fucking be recording the video motherfucking again bitch So yeah, this eyebrow pencil I'm using is in the shade brown and it's by revolution guys I loved 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 the way this works on my eyebrows as you can see it just slid on It wasn't too like in your face in your face and it was just perfect for the shade that I needed So yeah, this NYX product that I'm using right now is in the shade warm honey And I just want to say this concealer was very very great to me in contrast to the phone shade that I have been literally using, 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 using for the whole of my whole eyebrow career. But sometimes it's good to try different things. Sometimes you're going to find out that you like different products that work differently for different areas of your face. And this was just one of those days. I just wanted to try everything new. The way that it glided on my skin as well as the color match, it just proved that it was just the perfect concealer for me to be using underneath my brow as well as underneath my eyes, which you guys are going to see very, very shortly. So yeah, highly recommend this concealer. It just blended in perfectly. And yeah, it's perfect for natural days as well i can definitely see myself using this concealer just quickly underneath my eye or just like you know with a little bit of powder what i realized is that by the time i did my eyebrows i think i wanted more intensity so what i did is i grabbed my brown eye pencil from literally the hair shop and i just used that to fill it in a little bit more and get a little bit darker just to you know intensify what we was already working with because i know that shit was really cute but I wanted this to be like a look that was going to be like noticeable in the day like I didn't want it too natural but I didn't want it too like cakey or you know too much so I then grabbed my Maybelline New York Dream Urban Cover full coverage lightweight proactive makeup <laughs> foundation in the shade warm coconut three six sorry three five six and yeah, I just used it to just put the foundation all over my face. Use this lovely, lovely brush um, from this great set that I have had for about a year, over a year now, just about. But um, yeah, this foundation was very good. It was very warm. I love using foundations that are warmer than the usual because it's always easier to bring yourself up than it is to like start off too light and have to like use all this conceal, um, not concealer contour to like bring the makeup back down taking my nyx born to glow radiant concealer in the shade mahogany i then use that for the underneath my eyes and on the side of my cheekbones as well as using the maybelline concealer to go in the shade 30 to go on top of that just to like brighten it up because i did feel like that one was just too like a bit too natural so i wanted to bring up my under eyes a bit bit more and that's exactly what i did and then i just used my brush um it's a pointed what do they call these again do they call it tassel brushes or whatever i use one of those to um just get right in between the, the creases of my eyes and underneath my nose nose the side of my nose to like the side of my forehead I'm then going to take my NYX concealer in the shade Deep Walnut and then place that by my cheekbones, by my nose bridge, you know, underneath my nose bridge, by my, underneath my lip and then just like darken up those areas because we are adding back where the shadows will hit our face if we was in the sun, you know, not in the sun but in the shadows or whatever, you know how to explain it, you know, you've heard the yellow dazzle, okay, I know you've heard it, the, you know, the typical, you know, I know you heard it, so, yeah, get your concealer brush and then just like, you know, proper blend that in because we don't want to have just like a concealer that's just like a line, we don't want that shit, so you're going to get to get a thing and blend it out, then get your, any, any, any 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 powder that you like i've literally created this powder you see me using i've mixed like three different powder shades into this one powder shade and kind of like came up with my own concoction but um yeah i'm using the topaz ben eye powder to do the side of my cheekbones 
just to bring that out because I don't want it to be the same type of like baking as the one under my eye because the one underneath my eye I want it to be a different type of bake you understand what I mean I want my under eyes to be like shoo. I don't want my cheekbones to be like shoo. I don't want it to be like brr. do you know what I mean like I want it to be like shoo. so anyway I'm getting my lip pencil in the shade chestnut you know what they do you know what they do you know about the chestnut okay can't get started on the key code bro let me tell you about the key code this is the shade 07 you need to get that shade bitch get that shade as well as this blush palette let me put you guys on yeah you see that shade that i just used popping you know why because it gave me like the most rosiest cheek cheeky cheeks okay rosiest cheeky cheeks this little eyeshadow palette amazing 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 um not that pigmented um which is good for people who want to do natural makeup very very good for people who want to do natural day makeup it is very very good recommended palette i think this is the sleek palette in the shade 312 palette i'm not quite sure the link will be in the description box if it's not but i'm very sure that's the palette that it is um i forgot the time of the palette maybe it's 315 i don't remember but it's going to be in the description taking these shades i've just used that warm shade on the lid and i'm using this shade on the crease just to make it look a little bit more like this wasn't rushed you know this wasn't just like one shade <laughs> But really and truly, it's about two. <laughs> then I'm using this uh, black tattoo uh, Maybelline Eye Liquid Liner. And it was very good to me. Okay. It was very good to me. However, I will say, I got to say this. I got to say it. I got to come out and just say this. I don't fuck with this type of eyeliner brush. It just is not for me. Like it's not my it's not my thing. Like it's not my do 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 do. Like I don't like it. Like it's not nice. Like I could have messed this up like a million times. Then I'm gonna go back with my trusted mascara, guys. I'm not gonna lie. I don't really invest in mascara because you know why? I only use that shit to make my eyelashes black. Okay. After I took my powder and stuff, I need my eyelashes black. So girl, call me. Brushing that off with the the brush that I told you about. Did I tell you guys about this? No, I haven't. I know I haven't. So anyway. This brush you just saw me use the brush. I think I came in a set from TK Maxx, bitch. Go to TK Maxx. Get their fair and square, bitch. Get their early bird. Get the worm type shit, bitch. Go get their motherfucking office, bitch. They came in a pack, bitch. For 11 pounds, my guy. Yeah. Get up early. Okay. Moving on. These lashes. Bomb. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. So girl call me, call me any, any time that you want me uh, When you vex or you stress or depress any time you feel on it Yeah yeah So girl call me any 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 time that you want me uh, when, when you vex or you stress or depress any time you feel on it Yeah yeah So girl call me call me girl call me call me When you feeling honey Yeah. Uh -huh.